Hello, and welcome to this podcast from the Share English. It is a beautiful summer day. I am traveling on a train. Two women are on the train with me. The women sit opposite me. The women speak English. I don't understand much. I study English, but I am a beginner. I don't know many words. I start to speak to the women. I say some words in my basic English. The women understand what I want to say. I am happy. I say that I want to learn English. The women tell me that they are from England. They go home from a conference. Our conversation is 10 minutes long. The next station is my station. I say goodbye. The women give me their address and phone number. They tell me that I can visit them in England. Then we say goodbye. After this meeting, I work on my English every day. I translate texts and I watch films in English. In six months, my English is much better. It is good, but I want to know more. I go to London. I want to study English in London. When I am in London, I go to a school. My first lesson is on Monday. I meet my teacher and other students in the class. My teacher is a young lady. She is very nice. We say our names. We say where we are from. Then the lesson starts. Our teacher has a question for us. She wants to know how we study English. Our teacher says that she can teach us a very effective method to learn English. This method is very simple. Our teacher tells us that we don't have to study. We don't have to read textbooks, but we have to use English a lot. It is very good for me. I don't like studying and I don't like textbooks. Then we speak about what is important when we learn a new language. Our teacher tells us we need languages for communication. Languages help us say ideas and understand ideas. So when you learn a new language, the best method is to use the language for communication. And this is what we will do in our course. We will speak a lot. Many students try to remember new words. They also study grammar rules. And these students don't use English for speaking. They study about the language, but they don't use the language. Of course, you need to learn new words and new grammar, but you don't have to study them. In this course, I want to show you a very simple and effective method how to learn words and grammar. I like what our teacher says. Our lesson continues. We speak about our hobbies and what we do in our free time. We speak in pairs or with our teacher. We speak all the lesson. I like it. I am really happy. This system of learning is very good for me. Repeat after me. It is a beautiful summer day. It is a beautiful summer day. It is a beautiful summer day. I am traveling on a train. Two women are on the train with me. I am traveling on a train. Two women are on the train with me. I am traveling on a train. Two women are on the train with me. The women sit opposite me. The women speak English. The women sit opposite me. The women speak English. The women sit opposite me. The women speak English. I don't understand much. I study English, but I am a beginner.
I don't understand much. I study English, but I am a beginner. I don't understand much. I study English, but I am a beginner. I don't know many words. I start to speak to the women. I don't know many words. I start to speak to the women. I don't know many words. I start to speak to the women. I say some words in my basic English. I say some words in my basic English. I say some words in my basic English. The women understand what I want to say. I am happy. The women understand what I want to say. I am happy. The women understand what I want to say. I am happy. I say that I want to learn English. I say that I want to learn English. I say that I want to learn English. The women tell me that they are from England. The women tell me that they are from England. The women tell me that they are from England. They go home from a conference. They go home from a conference. They go home from a conference. Our conversation is 10 minutes long. The next station is my station. Our conversation is 10 minutes long. The next station is my station. Our conversation is 10 minutes long. The next station is my station. I say goodbye. The women give me their address and phone number. I say goodbye. The women give me their address and phone number. I say goodbye. The women give me their address and phone number. They tell me that I can visit them in England. They tell me that I can visit them in England. They tell me that I can visit them in England. Then we say goodbye. After this meeting, I work on my English every day. Then we say goodbye. After this meeting, I work on my English every day. Then we say goodbye. After this meeting, I work on my English every day. I translate texts and I watch films in English.
I translate texts and I watch films in English. I translate texts and I watch films in English. In six months, my English is much better. In six months, my English is much better. In six months, my English is much better. It is good, but I want to know more. It is good, but I want to know more. It is good, but I want to know more. I go to London. I want to study English in London. I go to London. I want to study English in London. I go to London. I want to study English in London. When I am in London, I go to a school. When I am in London, I go to a school. When I am in London, I go to a school. My first lesson is on Monday. My first lesson is on Monday. My first lesson is on Monday. I meet my teacher and other students in the class. My teacher is a young lady. I meet my teacher and other students in the class. My teacher is a young lady. I meet my teacher and other students in the class. My teacher is a young lady. She is very nice. We say our names. She is very nice. We say our names. She is very nice. We say our names. We say where we are from. Then the lesson starts. We say where we are from. Then the lesson starts. We say where we are from. Then the lesson starts. Our teacher has a question for us. Our teacher has a question for us. Our teacher has a question for us. She wants to know how we study English. She wants to know how we study English. She wants to know how we study English. Our teacher says that she can teach us a very effective method to learn English.
Our teacher says that she can teach us a very effective method to learn English. Our teacher says that she can teach us a very effective method to learn English. This method is very simple. This method is very simple. This method is very simple. Our teacher tells us that we don't have to study. Our teacher tells us that we don't have to study. Our teacher tells us that we don't have to study. We don't have to read textbooks, but we have to use English a lot. We don't have to read textbooks, but we have to use English a lot. We don't have to read textbooks, but we have to use English a lot. It is very good for me. I don't like studying and I don't like textbooks. It is very good for me. I don't like studying and I don't like textbooks. It is very good for me. I don't like studying and I don't like textbooks. Then we speak about what is important when we learn a new language. Then we speak about what is important when we learn a new language. Then we speak about what is important when we learn a new language. Our teacher tells us we need languages for communication. Our teacher tells us we need languages for communication. Our teacher tells us we need languages for communication. Languages help us say ideas and understand ideas. Languages help us say ideas and understand ideas. Languages help us say ideas and understand ideas. So when you learn a new language, the best method is to use the language for communication. So when you learn a new language, the best method is to use the language for communication. They study about the language, but they don't use the language. Of course, you need to learn so when new you learn words a new language, new grammar. The best method but is you don't to use have the to language study that. for communication. And this is what we will do in our course. And this is what we will do in our course.
And this is what we will do in our course. We will speak a lot. Many students try to remember new words. We will speak a lot. Many students try to remember new words. We will speak a lot. Many students try to remember new words. They also study grammar rules. And these students don't use English for speaking. They also study grammar rules. And these students don't use English for speaking. They also study grammar rules. And these students don't use English for speaking. They study about the language, but they don't use the language. They study about the language, but they don't use the language. They study about the language, but they don't use the language. Of course, you need to learn new words and new grammar. Of course, you need to learn new words and new grammar. Of course, you need to learn new words and new grammar. But you don't have to study them. But you don't have to study them. But you don't have to study them. In this course, I want to show you a very simple and effective method how to learn words and grammar. In this course, I want to show you a very simple and effective method how to learn words and grammar. In this course, I want to show you a very simple and effective method how to learn words and grammar. I like what our teacher says. Our lesson continues. I like what our teacher says. Our lesson continues. I like what our teacher says. Our lesson continues. We speak about our hobbies and what we do in our free time. We speak about our hobbies and what we do in our free time. We speak about our hobbies and what we do in our free time. We speak in pairs or with our teacher. We speak all the lesson. I like it.
We speak in pairs or with our teacher. We speak all the lesson. I like it. We speak in pairs or with our teacher. We speak all the lesson. I like it. I am really happy. This system of learning is very good for me. I am really happy. This system of learning is very good for me. I am really happy. This system of learning is very good for me.